today's neighborhood tour, we are going to be driving over to the Jordanel area in a location known as what is called Black Rock Ridge. What's up? My name is Nicole Bowdle. If you are new to my channel, I am a local real estate agent in Park City, Utah with Berkshire Hathaway Home Services. I help buyers, sellers, investors, as well as provide local insights on what it's like to live, work, and play here in the beautiful Park City area. And if this is someplace that you potentially want to land, you want to know more about, then make sure you subscribe to my channel. Also give this video a like and it helps the YouTube algorithm. This location is incredibly popular. It consists of condos and townhomes. Something to note is that there is also going to be a grocery store coming soon out here. So this is fantastic. You won't have to drive into Park City if you don't want to. However, you're really only 10 minutes from historic Main Street, Deer Valley Map, Deer Valley Resort and Park City Mountain Resort. This is an excellent location. Um, the prices for a condo generally start in the high fives and townhomes start in the sevens. There's also a new kind of hotel condo development out here called Black Rock Ridge. And then just across the way is what's known as Park's Edge and kind of the Jordan L Park. <music> is great because you get mountain living as well as lakeside living and you are 40 minutes to this area from the Salt Lake City International Airport and you basically have one stoplight to deal with. You don't have to deal with anything on 224. You can go around the horn and you can get off the Park City exit that is by the hospital, take a left and go under the freeway there and you'll end up kind of in this great area. Something to note about this area is that it does drop you into what they say it was located in Heber City. Even though you're literally five minutes from Park City, that's just the way that the county boundaries land over here. So something to note is that when you do buy over here, you end up in Wasatch County, not Summit County. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, you definitely want to check out this one next. And as always, drop down in the description down below to check out what is for sale currently in this neighborhood.